My dearest love, as I gaze upon you, I see a woman of immeasurable value, possessing a heart wide open and a remarkable sense of groundedness. It fills me with immense pride to witness the evolution you've undergone since the day our paths diverged. Personally, I find myself in the midst of a profound transformation, a journey that seems to be closely entwined with the burgeoning strength of my intuition. Throughout the period of our separation, I've engaged in deep contemplation, pondering over how I can mend the fractures I inadvertently caused. The no-contact phase, I admit, has cast a shadow of distrust and emotional distance between us. I refrain from placing any blame on you, as I willingly shoulder the responsibility for the misunderstandings that marred our connection. It was my initial deception about my true feelings that set the stage for the complications that ensued. In stark contrast, you exhibited unwavering authenticity and openness about your emotions and life circumstances, a quality for which I hold immense appreciation. Your transparency has been a guiding light in the tumultuous landscape of our relationship. Acknowledging the gravity of my past actions, I am resolute in my commitment to breathe new life into our connection. The silence that has pervaded our interactions needs to be shattered, and I am actively engaged in a process of self-improvement for this purpose. My earnest desire is to forge a fresh legacy with you, dismantling the chains that have hindered our closeness. I sense a potential erosion of your faith and hope, and it pains me deeply. Please know that I envision a future saturated with happiness and a resilient family bond. Your love, dear one, is unparalleled, pure, healing, and beyond comparison to any emotional or physical attraction I have ever encountered. The longing for the late-night conversations we once shared after demanding days is palpable. I miss returning home with the hope of finding solace in the presence of someone eagerly awaiting my arrival. The reality we find ourselves in now is far removed from the realm of my dreams. Never did I anticipate a scenario where you would turn away from me. While past conflicts were inevitably fraught with complications, they were ultimately resolved, and you returned after a period of necessary introspection. However, the current circumstances feel markedly different. Your guarded and silent demeanor leaves me grappling with uncertainty. I find myself wondering if you can summon the strength to forgive me, my love. The journey toward reconciliation may be arduous, but I am steadfast in my commitment to proving the sincerity of my remorse and the authenticity of my transformation. Have you ever found yourself grappling with the bewildering aftermath of a loved one's sudden departure, leaving your heart shattered and your emotions in disarray? In the realm of tarot cards, such emotional tumult finds expression in the enigmatic symbolism of the Three of Swords, the harbinger of heartbreak and disloyalty. The card paints a vivid tableau of a heart pierced by swords, an evocative portrayal of the excruciating pain inflicted by a third party entwined in the dynamics of a once intimate connection. The Three of Swords extends an invitation to introspection, urging the wounded soul to confront the shards of heartache before charting a course forward. It serves as a poignant reminder that healing is a prerequisite for any meaningful progression. This card becomes a mirror reflecting the poignant narrative of pain and heartbreak that paved the way for the disintegration of the once shared bond. Notably, it reveals the presence of another individual, not romantically entangled but casually connected with both parties, casting shadows upon the sanctity of the relationship. As the narrative unfolds, the tarot journey ventures into the terrain of the Two of Cups, a card that encapsulates the essence of deep connection and profound love. The imagery of two figures embracing against the backdrop of a cup overflowing with love serves as a testament to the intensity of the emotional tapestry woven between the K-Rent and the departed soul. Here, the tarot cards unravel a story beyond the superficial realms of physical attraction, 
a narrative of a connection anchored in the bedrock of unconditional love. The Two of Cups elucidates that what existed between the individuals surpassed the ordinary contours of romantic entanglement. Instead, it bore the hallmarks of a connection rooted in mutual understanding and unwavering support. This love, the card suggests, transcended the boundaries of conventional experiences, resonating with a depth that surpassed any prior encounters. Yet, paradoxically, this profound love, intense and all-encompassing, seemed to awaken latent fears and insecurities within the departed soul. Enter the realm of the Eight of Cups, a card that unfolds the tale of emotional withdrawal and self-reflection. The imagery of an individual walking away from a stack of cups becomes a metaphor for the painful act of disengagement and the imperative need for profound self-reflection. In the intricate language of tarot, this card signifies a departure driven not by a disinterest or lack of care, but by an internal struggle, unresolved issues that extend to the realms of love, intimacy, and self-worth. The Eight of Cups compels us to recognize that the decision to sever ties wasn't a reflection of apathy but rather a consequence of the departed individual's internal strife. They grapple with deep-seated issues, wrestling with questions of self-worth and an intricate tapestry of emotions related to intimacy and love. It becomes evident that the departure wasn't an abandonment but a profound act of self-preservation, a journey to confront personal demons and attain a sense of deservingness for a connection as profound as the one shared. I deeply apologize for drawing comparisons between you and others. The love and kindness you've shown me are truly unparalleled, and I want to express my sincere regret for any hurt I may have caused. It's crucial for you to understand that causing you pain was never my intention, and I'm grappling with the weight of realizing that I rejected your love due to the fear of external judgment. These days, my mind is incessantly occupied with thoughts of you. I've undergone a silent struggle of mental torture and emotional breakdowns, similar to the challenges you've faced. However, I chose to keep these struggles to myself, not wanting to project any semblance of emotional weakness to the outside world. This decision, while seemingly self-preserving, has led to an inner turmoil that I can no longer contain. The absence of contact with you has become a source of genuine pain for me. I am genuinely worried that my actions have eroded the faith you once had in me and my promises. It's a heavy realization that the fear of judgment led me to reject a love that is undoubtedly precious. I find myself yearning for the restoration of our connection, which has been severed by my regrettable choices. In the midst of my internal struggles, I acknowledge the hurt I've caused and the toll it has taken on both of us. I am genuinely sorry for tarnishing the connection we shared by resorting to blocking or ignoring. It was a misguided attempt to cope with my own fears, and I now see the damage it has inflicted. Moving forward, my sincere desire is to rebuild the trust that has been fractured. I want to be the cause of the smile on your face once again, mending what I have unintentionally spoiled. I am committed to understanding and addressing the pain I've caused, with the hope that we can navigate through these challenges together and emerge stronger on the other side.